All right, greetings. Uh, tonight on Love Island. No, I'm just. No. Yeah. So we've been vibing pretty hard. So we're trying to keep it a hundred. <laughs> and uh, literally. Literally. <laughs> literally trying to keep it a hundred. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Vibing hard. So hard. Vibing hard. Yeah, hundred percent. You can't. No, you don't answer her hundred with your hundred. No, you just. Hundred, 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 hundred. 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 Like hundred. literally. <laughs> Sally's a sweet girl, but yeah, literally every two seconds is. Literally, kind of drives me. Crazy. I don't. Literally. I don't think you need to keep saying literally. I don't think that's you need not to. Not literal at all. And and even if it were, you you don't need to keep means. saying it. You don't even need to keep saying it. It's not necessary in that sentence. So. <laughs> I don't think that word means what you think it means. That's that's what I that's <laughs> what I was thinking of was yeah, Princess Bride definitely. It's not. All right, so here on the entertainment guy, we are going to discuss, and I'm I'm wearing hockey. This is a shirt we got for for being honest. Uh, we both got got one of these from the Canucks store because like a when they sweater. when they sent when they sent me giant sixteen by twenty huge. pictures, they're huge. I bid on one, but they sent me two of the Bo Horvats, and then they sent me a Henrik Sedin that I didn't order, and so I called, I contacted them and said, "What do you want me to do?" And they're like, "So you're being honest." Cool. So they gave us these for free because uh, we brought them back. So and they're in they're in great condition. I didn't mess with them and I didn't try to sell them or nothing like that. So uh, there you go. Here's your uh, no good deed goes unpunished. That's what it is, right? I think so. All right. So what we've got here is we've got a box from Lars. Now Lars is uh, the resident uh, dictator over the channel. <laughs> people think he's the one that bans people and. Puts people in timeout all the time during the live streams. Which is really funny, funny cause because most of the time it's me. I remember years ago, but three years ago, Lars people would blame uh, moderators when it was me. Yeah. They would blame Sean Avery. Sean Avery was always yeah. the one that got blamed, and it was usually me that was doing yeah. it. Yeah. Right? And like, now no, they no, blame I, Lars, I, and I it's usually him. me. I'm the one that... I mean, they're the moderators absolutely put people in timeout, but I'm, I'm usually... And I'm much, I'm much faster the with the ban hammer. I'm much faster with the ban hammer than others. We're like, hey, yeah. why are you well, timing yeah, out? Just ban them. Because I've seen where moderators will time out, and I'm like, nah, yeah, ban. Yeah, we don't need to deal with that crap. <laughs> but then they nah. blame Lars, and yeah. it's not Lars. Yeah, it's funny. So Lars, Poor in exchange Lars. for uh, his continued payment through me uh, for his employment, <laughs> uh, has sent us a... a <laughs> for all of his work, he a box sent us candy a box of candy which is good because he owes me <laughs> and so in that uh let's go ahead and get into this because these are this might is, make note lars is from sweden so it's all he, this is all swedish he sent us swedish candy which a lot which of candy. in french is la sweden la it's swedish it's not that's not that's not hot. no okay yum okay oh, so those are good uh, toffee filled mint candies. I assume these are diet. Yeah, it's all in. I totally stole a few of those last time. It's all time. in Swedish. Uh, Enter Glacidus, uh, Rocks of Fett, which is Boba they're Fett's almost, sister. They're very similar that's, to humbugs, so they're great. That's fine. Those humbugs are fantastic. Those are so that's good. Oh, sweet. Yes. So uh, are these are these are good. So they're favorites. they're Ferrari shaped. Well, not Ferrari shaped, not really, but maybe old Ferrari. Car. They're they're car shaped uh, cola treat, but because they're they're hard, I can just basically just throw one in my mouth. I'm not, not like eating handfuls, which yeah. with jujubes can get yeah. dangerous. But with these, I find I don't because I've lost about thirty pounds off where I was, and I don't want to get back to where I was because that right. wasn't fun. Right. So the internet likes to remind you about it. So oh yes. Nice this, I oh like yeah, that. I remember those. This. Black those licorice. are the those Shannon are the black like licorice. These are the ones that are all salty. It even says yeah. salta right on it. These are the salted licorice, which again, Where are you gonna put all these? The salted licorice is good because again, it takes me a while to eat it. It's not something that I can just take the. the I would have there's so much. They're salt. like the um, the floral gums, or where they're right. they're not like uh, gummies. They're they're hard. Oh, these are yours. Oh yeah. And sugar-free gummies, because I don't eat sugar. These are mine too. Are they? Yeah. It just says an anus and passion. I'm not sure. 
what it's going for there. No, that means, well, it's the same as in French. An anus Pineapple. And passion? Pineapple is an anus. I'm not sure pineapple. that's how it's pronounced. Okay. The word is pineapple. That's, that's oh, this that's stuff's great. This is that uh, cola. Oh, yeah, the laces. Cola caramel laces. These are fantastic. Because it says cola, but I seem to remember these were caramel flavored when I got into them last time. Remember it was caramel flavored laces? Oh, okay, yeah. And even if they're cola, that's good too. I am perfectly you know, fine with that. There's, I don't think there's English. Doesn't need English. There's a lot of languages though. Oh, English there is. is obsolete. Syrup, wheat, flour, sugar, sorbitol, hydrogenated coconut fat. Everything smells like licorice it's and flavoring. it's delicious. Flavoring, so that's what's in it. Flavoring? Flavor. Oh, good, it has flavor. flavor. So that's always good. This is one of those bags the of bulk? randomness. Random sugar. Random. Nice. This is a uh, sock sock luck sock luck <laughs> Sock luck So you know that Lars is gonna make like a video of it. Okay, you totally killed it. This is how you. Oh, it's made of soccer. Looks. Check that out. It's got soccer in it. That's because from Europe. Europe loves soccer, so this has soccer in it. They call it soccer there. And it has glucosarap in it. Now okay. I wasn't sure I like glucosarap, but apparently I do. Those are for me. Are they? Are they yeah. floral? Yeah, these are violet candies. Well, there you go. Well, he we said oh there was gosh. violet candies in there, so. I don't know if you can't see this. It's a whole bag full of violet candies, because he knows I like violet candies. Those are great. Milk chocolate. Now, I'm going to guess that that means uh, toffee flavored <laughs> treats. <laughs> and they're for ballerinas. So I'll see if I can find one. Well, it says right here ballerina. I'm not a ballerina. So I'm not allowed to eat these, but I'll find hot a ballerina, I promise. That's me. Hot. You're hot and sour? Oh, hot and sour. Hot and sour. <laughs> I... Like hen... I don't know why I keep looking at the back. There's not English. This is Turkish Bieber, which I think was... Uh, this is uh, Justin Bieber's Turkish uh, <laughs> It looks like cousin. something spicy too, eh? Turkish, oh, Turkish mega Bieber. hot. So. Good luck with that one. Too hot to handle. It does have English on it. L.A. Critzy. So. Looks like licorice too. And it's smooth. Smooth Salmiak. Salmiak is, uh, he was part of, see, back in the War of 1812. Oh, Shannon. Colonel Salmiak. Oh, Shannon. What? What's this? Piles. These Why are, are you putting it in piles? Oh, you got so more of the sugar-free. Oh. More okay, fine. I'll put that there. Toffee caramel, chew, chewy Sounds caramel great. toffee coated with chocolate. Cat. Let's see, what does it say here? I'll read it. Go ahead and go through this Spanish on the back. Yeah, see, cola's there. So K O L A, cola, that has to be uh, caramel. Oh, maybe. So, sweets with benefits. Oh, hey. Hi. <laughs> ah. Sweets with benefits. What exactly is exchanged for these candies in Sweden? And they're tweak. <laughs> this is 92% less sugar than 100% sugar so it's only 8% sugar <laughs> fiber the first ingredient is fiber oh svart licorice <laughs> you know svart licorice is uh, for musta laku fence licorice muke got good muke oh god that's what that is that's muke oh god that means, dear Lord, these are good. They're they're first first. They're first king good. They're first king first king godly good. You know, what? if this is the first video that somebody lands on, they're like, oh my gosh, this man is just mocking. See, this is full of sugar their too. Language. Soccer. See. Soccer is that sugar? It's sweet as sugar. It's made out of soccer balls. They really like their sugar over there. Tweak. The new candy. I didn't know I liked Fargamni. Here we are. Right there. Anisolia. I don't know that that's like real food. It's like it's probably one of those ingredients. There's glucosa wrap again. And melass. <laughs> that's probably molasses because this is probably a licorice. Just says melass. Just says probably melass. Probably licorice, so that would be molasses. So I'm not sure how close Mel got to this, but okie dokie then. Mini favorites mix. Oh, Fun. that's I. 
Dame Coco. Marabou. Oh, I like the Marabou. Nougat. 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 It's got uh, Palm, Shea. There's that soccer again. It's the number one ingredient. They really like their soccer because it's the number one ingredient on everything. Everything is made of soccer in Sweden. Well I find it, find out new things. Those are fun. I like finding out new things about Sweden. You're such a dork. Everything's oh, made out of different soccer. Different kind of tweak. Sweet with benefits. I'm tweak Fruity. sweet with benefits. Fruity, fruity tweak with benefits. I can't make this up. Oh, different elephants. And more cats. Oh, this is Jord Bear. Or Jord Gub. Jord Bear, Jord Gub. Is that the name of the elephant? Or is that like the name of the stuff that's in it? Jord Bear, Jord Gub. Oh my goodness. Poor Lars has to look at you just slaughter. Especially after he makes the video slaughter. telling us what everything he is. He does. He does a And video. he goes through and he and enunciates all of it. And, and here he, I am, Jord Bear, Jord Gub. Look up <laughs> what the translation for some of the ingredients is too. So. Yeah, this is I'm made sorry, out of soccer. Lars. A lot of soccer in this too, and there's Shannon. there's more of the cola, it's more soccer. It's snore cola, and it's knee smacky smack smag. No, look, it's see, it says knee smack smag. That sounds painful, a knee smack smag. Sounds like sounds like some kind of an injury you might have. So we got two of the cats. No, I think there's three of the cats. Is there three of the cats? Yeah, the oh, good. Because, yeah, that's really the like stuff those. that lasted. That's the stuff that lasted last time. Because, again, a lot of the time when I snack, it's not that I'm hungry. It's that I'm, I, you know, I, I just, it's it's nice to have something to snack on, chew on. So, since I don't chew tobacco, because that's disgusting. Um, True. That means snacks. And snacks can be disgusting if you have too many of them. And so, uh, they're not. Oh, this has mare filming. 25% mare filming. So, now mare is no, French no, for no, sea. No, no, no. It no, is. I, I, ah, I know see? what mare means. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And, and French for mother. So what this means is that it is, your your mother has filled this with 25% more love. That's, that's what it means for these. That's what that means. Oh, poor Lars. No, that's what it means. Mare filming. He doesn't need to fix anything. He doesn't need to correct anything because I'm right. It has 25% mare filming, which means your mother loves it more by 25%. You're such a dork. Oh, no, there's more cats because you put one over here. Oh, yeah, there's four We've of them then. Four bags of cats. Four bags of cats, which is good because we have four cats. <gasps> so that works. We have it's a bag like for each you. cat. As if the cats would ever touch licorice or salted licorice especially. I think he knows can I, you like cola and Can like I take this doesn't come hotter than this and kind of cut that out and make a magnet out of it and <laughs> throw that on the board? It's tiny. So? There's lots of side. tiny magnets. What are you trying to get at? That's Turkish Peeber. I might want to try these and do a video. Oh, too hot to handle. Too cold to hold. They call them Ghostbusters because they're in control. Wait, why are there two best before dates? I know it's a package on date. I just figured I'd... Be a dork. Be a dork, yeah. You are, idea. indeed. Parasta, Enon, Bast, Fjord. Oh, Fjords. Oh, good. I was hoping there'd be Fjords. Fjords are more of a Norwegian thing, aren't they? Is there Fjords used in the makings of the... I thought that was more of a Norwegian thing. Oh, but I guess there's Swedish Fjords. Icelandic Fjords. Lots of Fjords. Why don't we have Fjords? We should have Fjords. Because we're in Canada. That's why. But there's an ocean right there. We should have fjords. It, no. Didn't North America come with fjords? Can we no. bake a fjord? No. It's not how it works. We just get screwed over at every every turn. Right. Yeah, that's how it works. Pepper candies. So sugar, glucose syrup, ammonium chloride, licorice extract, salt, mm, flavorings, vegetable oil, rapeseed? It's a it's a plant. It's a flower. Oh, okay. It grows not too far from here. It's, okay. It's, you, have you ever right. seen the yellow Col fields? Coloring. Okay, we'll move on. Coloring foods. Uh, Sounds like it canola oil. Color. It's from right I don't want to know what they have to do to get canolas. 
Store in a dry and cool place. Uh, producer, Phaser Confectory, Confectionery in Finland. So he stole this from Finland. He actually went across the border, stole this from Finland, and then mailed it to us. I, I'm grateful to him for his his bravery in that. That's something. Probably had to trade like a Hayskin and rookie card to get across the border. Because right now those are like just, you know, those are money to, to people from Finland. Or to me because I like Hayskin. But, you know, that's fun. I like that. That's good. Does make so yeah, uh, thank you, Lars. Um, That's fun. That is very fun. It's a lot of sugar-free candy. It's gonna last me forever. <laughs> yeah, it's it is gonna last us a long time. The last box lasted us months. A very long time. It was months. Yeah. Because uh, again, I I don't want to end up getting back to previous sizings and whatnot. So I've been doing five miles plus on the treadmill every day, mm. and um, that's with that in mind and putting myself through uh, the first couple of seasons of Legends of Tomorrow, which it's it's I'll, I'll make it i'll make it and i'll be proud of myself I actually i i will admit i skipped four episodes yesterday yeah i i started an episode i was like oh god no i can't do i can't do this and i had to skip to to the climax to the end of the season for season two because <laughs> so i was like this is too stupid it just you can't have a series where the heroes are constantly stupider than the villains Right. And and Hero Legends of Tomorrow for the first two seasons they are always one step behind, and they're stupid, they're so dumb. So yeah, um, I'll do a video on that at some point. I'm gonna go through each season and then I'm gonna get some talking points for it and talk about how that show has improved for people who don't watch it, or for people who might have watched it and fell out of love with the show and, and get into why I still watch it and why I like it and why when I decided to have Yvonne watch them like we could just start in season four. Yeah. You just start in season four. Hot and sour. We should make the kids try these. Why? I would like hot and sour. Because it'd be funny. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Thanks, Lars. Greatly appreciated. It'd be funny. And uh, your your uh, reciprocal packages in the mail. Do we have any idea how long that's going to take to get there? Did they tell it's you? It's not supposed to take too long. I have tracking, but I haven't okay. checked it. Okay. I didn't think I sent them tracking. I do have tracking though. It comes with it automatically when you have to spend a stupid amount to send a parcel to Europe, apparently. And and I, this is why I used to cross the border. And then what what made it more expensive too is we were including States. a lot of meat, which we hope is still good for when it gets there. Um, there's a Whopper. There's a Big Mac. We included some chicken too, right? We included some ice cubes though, so it should stay cool for the whole trip. Um, we put right on there, don't thaw on the box, so it should be fine. Uh, it, uh, but if chicken is a week old at room temperature, all you have to do is nuke it for about 30 seconds and it's good. That, that kills it. I really and, just keep thinking, if this and is the first video, somebody as watches. As Granny always said, a little salmonella never hurt anybody. So. Well, I don't know if your grandmother was like my grandmother, but she would leave meat. Well, um, she well, she just she would eventually leave meat in the oven. I assume she just eventually like, just got an immunity oh, to salmonella. My grandmother had a stomach of steel because she would just leave meat out. She uh -huh. had a tiny fridge, cook a roast, and you just store it in the oven. The oven's not on. You just because there's room in the oven to just have the roast in there in like the next month. Oh, Nanan. Oh no, it's fine. There's room in there for it. All right, so enjoy your meat when it gets there. Uh, we also encased it in some really nice mayonnaise to keep it nice and, and well. Uh, ew. Oh, my gosh. What's ew for? That's so mayonnaise is a natural. It's sort of like, it's like styrofoam, but gooey. It's like a gooey Slimy. foam, and it'll actually keep everything nice and moist Greasy? and fresh. Not Keeps fresh. everything fresh. Mayonnaise so won't even be fresh. So we're looking oh. forward. Oh, it's fine. It's made of eggs. Eggs don't go bad. So... Uh, they they go rotten. They don't go bad. So once you've actually bought the eggs and you've used the eggs, they can't go bad after that because you've already prevented them from going rotten. So problem solved. It's All right. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And no, I'm not a medical doctor. Um, <laughs> Surprise! So, <laughs> thanks, thanks for watching. Thanks again, Lars. Uh, we will put this to good use. And uh, good use, yes. 
Yep. Yep, absolutely. I just have one of these in my pocket and we're, we're good. I can eat like two or three of these in a day and that saves me from possibly eating some snacks I probably shouldn't. All right. Uh, yeah, so thanks for all your support and uh, we will talk to you again soon. Till then, we'll be vibing hard, 100%. keeping it 100, 100%. And I plan well, to... at the end of the day. I, well, that's... at the end of the day, the important thing is I, I want to get the full experience of the villa. So... I'm I'm paired up, but I'm I'm keeping my options open, and I want to get to know the new girls. So it's important, you know, to to get important. the full experience. Important. It's, it's not important. It's important. It and and you got to get the full experience while you're here. So I'm trying to get the full experience. That's really important to me. Important. And uh, as long as you know you're not going <laughs> all crazy vibing. and stuff. Oh, I'm vibing hard. 100%. So, yeah. Uh, uh, we will talk to you again soon.